Hey, I hope you guys enjoyed this video that you're about to see now. Just make sure that you subscribe and click on the little bell because that's the only way to get notifications. Those digital nomads you see on YouTube promote travel but don't really tell you 100% of the truth about what they do. They could be selling drugs. <laughs> yeah, I mean, nah, people, there's a thing too. There's a, a big scheme, you know, I'm masking the digital nomads of YouTube. I'm I'm, I'm putting this is gonna be the section where we unmask digital nomads. <laughs> There's a lot of digital nomads out there that are poppy and mommy's kids, meaning like, hey, little Sean got a a a, a, a freaking trust fund, and every month you know it's like he got a four hundred thousand dollar trust fund, and every month he get you know eight hundred nine hundred dollars per month back. You get what I'm saying? And he gets a little money extra on the side. And, and if things go bad, mommy says, hey, little Sean, are you okay? Are you in Thailand right now? Here's some money for you, little Sean. Right? So let's unmask it. Right? Taking off the mask for, for the, the fake digital nomads, guys who, who be faking it hard. Right? So what happens is, I don't know if you heard of that term where it says, fake it till you make it. This happens a lot with digital nomads on YouTube. They talk about, hey, man, I've got uh, an amazing uh, course on how to travel the world, how to travel for free, how to uh, make money from blogs. You look at their Alexa, nobody visits their website. They barely get any traffic, which doesn't make sense because it's like if you're traveling the world, you need you need to be making money. But it's like, nah, they don't make money. Some people, they just scheme it, right? So they fake it till they make it, right? They end up with 50,000 subscribers. They end up with 100,000 subscribers. So now money is coming in. Now they got an audience. But in the beginning, they faked it, right? It took them the whole time to fake it until they made it. You get what I'm saying? And even for YouTubers or web developers out here, there's guys who just, they pay for, uh, you know, they pay for uh, subscribers. You know, people pay for advertising on Facebook. They pay for a whole bunch of stuff. And like, let's say they go to India, right? India, Philippines, uh, even Dominican Republic, and get a whole bunch of subscribers from there that is super cheap to get those subscribers. To get an American subscriber costs a lot of money, but to get a subscriber from those countries, uh, you know, up and coming countries, third world countries, whatever you want to call them, right? They basically are very cheap. Right, you pay for the advertising, it's, it, it costs almost nothing, right? So, I might come in, I might be a legit developer out here, right? Or a legit digital nomad, but I only have a thousand five hundred subscribers, right? Uh, little Johnny from the side has a hundred thousand subscribers, so now an American sees that and says, Oh man, the guy that has a hundred thousand subscribers, he's the legit one. But what they don't know is that people bought those subscribers, right? People bought those views. So now they faked it until they made it. Once they faked it, right? And they get 200,000 subscribers, 300,000 subscribers. Now those extra 200, 300,000 subscribers on top of their fake 100,000 subscribers, 300,000 subscribers are legit. So those people now give them money. You get what I'm saying? I don't know if you understand uh, how it is. It's like people fake it at first, and then once they're on and people see like, oh, this person has 100,000 subscribers, now those new subscribers are quality subscribers. So now they really make the money that they tell people that, um, you know, that they're like, oh, I'm traveling for the world for free. It's like, yeah, now you're paying for it from the YouTube ads, and now you're paying for it from the traffic. But at first, you faked it. You wasn't getting no money. You wasn't popping out here. You know what I'm saying? So that's what happens, right? Hey guys, this video is brought to you by viewers like you and people that support our website, codingphase.com. Go check it out. Over 20 courses in there that's going to guide you to become a developer from the beginning to becoming a pro.